I think what made me want to be involved was having that opportunity to focus on my own craft. MIF has always been on my radar. I've always wanted to be involved. Um, I mean, I saw this advertiser, I thought it was a great opportunity to see a commission come together from the beginning to the, to the show. I was attached to the Anvil um, and it was 15 contemporary responses to the Peterloo Massacre. I've never given myself the freedom to just call yourself an artist and have some learning time and I think that's what was the most attractive for me. The best thing about the fellowship is meeting all the other fellows, definitely. We all have very different practices, also very different backgrounds and perspectives on our work and other people's work and on the festival itself. I've been attached to Tree. I've absolutely loved it, the whole thing. Looking at what Kwame does and what I do, it doesn't look that different. Um, however, I can see that he's much more experienced than I am. I feel fortunate that I've been able to do that. Not many artists can say that they can do that. A lot of artists are, are completely stuck in the studio. I was attached to the School of Integration, which is by Tanya Vergara, and it was hosted at the Manchester Art Gallery. During the fellowship, was a fantastic opportunity to see um, more behind the scenes at the International Festival. So usually as a director, you're the person bringing it from idea to screen or stage. So it's been really great seeing another creative team do that and how they approach that and the decisions they make to reach the conclusions that they ultimately get to. For the festival, I've been attached to Studio Creole, which is a really interesting project that combines literature, live art, performance. Um, so it's been an exciting journey to see the project develop. It's been really reassuring because actually I think we all expected to go into all of these big companies and these big artists and sort of see the magic tricks of how to make huge pieces of work come together. And actually what we've all realised is that they are basically doing the same things that we already do just on a much larger scale. It's been amazing. I think one of my favourite parts of it is just getting to know Nakash, Remy, Jack, Yusra, um, Caroline because we're, we all come from such different backgrounds as artists. Throughout this process I've learned how they work with things and how they deal with issues that have arisen as artists for them and I'm really grateful for that.